knowledge and live happily. He is the offerer of the facility among all the planets. Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Kanjanur the Sukra Sanctum This is situated in about 3 kilometers distance from the Sun Temple and near the Narsingan Peta railway station. Brahma, Agni Deva are worshipped in this place. Upper Swami Gul sang that I got mukti after the great darshan of Lord Shiva who was worshiped by Brahma Vishnu praised by the Agni Deva who is the savior god situated in Kanjanur the king the celestial tree of offering This is where the Haradatta Shivacharya sat on the red hot iron seating and composed offered various sanskrit literatures on the philosophy of Lord Shiva establishing the greatness of shiva religion this is the place where manak kanjara nayanar as whole utterly offer the tress of his lovely daughters on the auspicious day of her wedding to lord shiva who was in disguised appearance like brahmin complying his request God here is Agnishwar God is here is Karpaga Nayaki By worshiping this god all the barriers of in obstetric business will vanish resulting in flourishing life It is good to visit here and worship this god for those who do not have the Venus in the prophet position in their horoscope. The Lord Nadraj Sivakami Ammai are in the form of statues made of black granite. The Lord Vishnu got born in this place. This is an ideal place to remove the flaws of the Venus. The Lord Venus is also called as the prelate of monsters venus vellu the lord venus tenders subtle sense happy life companion language sagacity governess of the nine gems the skill of attracting others caring the employees he is known as the rain planet he is white dressed marked up with white lotus garland he is faced on the east The Lord Venus will grant life flourishing boons to those who worship him by presenting white lotus garland on Fridays. Tirunallar the sunny sanctum This is the sanctum of Lord Sunny Bhagavan. This is one of the seven holy sanctum. The Lord Tyagesar is also known as the Nagara Vidangar. This fortune created by Kali Dosha to the king Nala has been cleared after worshiping this god. The presence of Lord Sunny and the movement of Saturn or the specialities. This place is also appraised as Nala Puri, Vishnu Puri. Brahmapuri Indrapuri Darbaranyam The holy water here is Saraswati Tirtham Nala Tirtham in addition to 25 more tirthams Namah Shiva
festive celebrations will happen and holy water will be distributed on vaikasi visagam om 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 Vinayagar here is also known as Swarna Vinayagar and Karpaga Vinayagar. Thiringyana Sambandha Murthy Swamigal has used this sanctum in his poems to win over the heated discussions with Jains. This poem start with the name of goddess as Bhogamartha Poon Mulayal which is also known as பச்சை பதிகம் காட் ஹியர் இஸ் நாலேஸ்வரர் தர்ப ஆரண்யேஸ்வரர் ஆதிபுரீசர் காட் இஸ் ஹியர் இஸ் பூகமார்த்த பூன் முலையம்மை பிராணாம்பா The sanctum was localized by Upper Sundarar Sambandar. The speciality of the sanctum is a royal tower, Rajagopuram, which has five stages. The king of Nidada, Nala, lost his country home and wandered in forests. And at last he reached the sanctum and was set free from the misfortune created by Kali Dosha, by worshipping this god namasiva the stala tree here is darbai pul sacrificial grass the saint tringyana sambandar has praised the sanctum that nallar sanctum is a place where king nala has worshiped regularly tringyana sambandar continues his praisings that Lord Shiva who is wearing the crescent moon on his head prized by all celestials as their leader worshiped by the celestials likewise the lord is present here in tirunallaru to save his devotees we shall worship this god to evade from the invalid azards such as chronic disease vain blame curse distress evil deeds of former births loss and business during the presence of lord sunny bhagavan it will give the best results by lighting the sesame lamp offering sesame rice along with dark violet flower garland on saturdays all the devotees who suffer in life during the seven and of sunny period janma sunny period of the lord sunny's migration periods can read the poem bhogamartha poon mulayal regularly திரு நாகேஸ்வரம் தி சாங்டம் ஆஃப் ராகு திஸ் இஸ் த ஹோலி சாங்டம் ஆஃப் லார்ட் ராகு பகவான் சேக்கிழார் வாஸ் வெரி மச் டிவோட்டட் டு திஸ் சாங்டம் Temple built by him at Kundratur was also named as Tirunagiswaram. Tirunagiswaram is also called as Senbagaranya. There are 12 Tirthas here. Surya Pushkarini, Kanya Tirtham, Imaya Tirtham, Indra Tirtham, Gautama Tirtham and Nala Tirtham are the notable Tirthas. God here is Naganadar Magalingam. Goddess here is Kundru Mulayammai 
Giri Kusambal. Sekiryar's divine image is kept in the temple. Sekiryar Hall was built by Sekiryar. Sanganidi, Padumanidi, Mahashasta idols are also here. This is the disease curing sanctum. Brahma, Surya, Indra, I worship the sanctum. Stala tree here is Shandagam. The sanctum shall be worshipped to avert the azards of the Lord Raghu. We can see the color of milk poured upon the Lord Raghu Bhagavan turned to a dark violet color in the outlet area. We can attain the best effects by anointing and worshipping the Lord on any day with offerings black cloth, topaz, orchid flower, black gram rites. The Lord Raghu Bhagavan has worshipped the God to sacrifice his diabolic nature and to attain godliness. The Sanctum of Ketu Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Ganabadi Om Kirpirumbalam, the sanctum of Lord Kedu, is situated near Tarangambadi. God here is Naganada Swami. Goddess here is Saundara Nayagi. The serpent Vasugi has worshipped the Lord Shiva, devotedly to come out of the sins. The God is called as Naganada, as Lord Shiva has graced his blessings to Vasugi. The sanctum is considered as the place where goddess has stopped the venom in the phranics of Lord Shiva. This is a beautiful and large temple. Kedu has attained godliness with his own efforts, even though he is a demon by birth. Om. 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 Lord Kedu has got blessings from the Lord by worshipping him sincerely at this sanctum. The demon Swaravagu, the grandson of Saint Kashyaba, has turned to Lord Kedu. All these Navagraha temples are situated near Kumbakonam. We can go to all the sanctums by staying at Mayavaram or Kumbakonam. Om. Om. 
Everything will get resolved by visiting the sanctums if any flaws in life or if any trouble in the business. The worship of the God will increase our courage and self-confidence. <laughs>